engineering videos and technical solutions, BTEC and master engineering thesis guidance, simulation of projects using different software such as MATLAB, PVSYS, Helioscope, ETAP, and many more. Detailed videos on these topics and much more available software such as AutoCAD, Revit, and SketchUp. Be part of our family by subscribing to our YouTube channel, follow us on Instagram, like our Facebook page, and visit our website. PZ Engineering. Passion to excel. Hi, welcome to the PZ Engineering channel. In this video, we are going to show how to simulate PI controller based on the voltage regulation of a PV inverter in MATLAB Simulink software. If you are not yet part of our family, please subscribe to the channel, share our contents, comment and like this video. This is our system and I will go through each component. Here we have our PV array. 40 parallel, 10 series connected. Those are the parameters of our PV array. Here we have our capacitor one. This is the value of our capacitor one. Here we have our voltage measurement, which goes to there. Here you have our universal bridge. Here's the, uh, the, the ADNJ is any, anything. This is, is the is the control part that triggers the universal bridge, our inverter. This is the, that goes there, and then this is the that comes from controller. Here we have our three phase parallel, and then we have our three phase parallel RLC branch, and here we have our Three phase VI measurement. And we have our load demand. That's the voltage of our load demand, which will be our load demand. The parameters are there. Here we have our control um, our, our that from PV goes to the measurement. And here we have our uh, V that comes from our VI measurement of our gain is a reference voltage. Here we have our PL three phase, three phase, and here we have our our ADC to DP transformation mark. You can follow it. Here we have our selector. We select, indicate which one, and here is represent our VD and VQ. It goes to our PI controller. These are the values of our PI controller. You can just follow it step by step. And this, all of those components you can get from the library browser. Here are our, our, and then you have our PI double, PI double generator. Those are the values. And here we have our, that goes to the gate. That triggers the inverter. And here we have the power is in the one to the power minus six. Those are the measurements is to the scope to, to, to measure the output. Now let's run our system.
let's check our PV voltage and current. And let's just calculate the power output. Now let's run again and reduce the running time. Let's check the output power from the PV. And let's change our solar irradiation. As we know, it affects the output power. Let's check the output voltage and current as, as we change the irradiation, solar irradiation. As you can see, the power is changing. Let's keep on changing our solar irradiation. Let's check the AC output. Let's keep on changing. Let's just keep on changing it. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Share our contents comment and like this video